A sailboat owner, a sailboat owner is taking a new approach to raise money for those in need. And what better way to fundraise than to take families out for a relaxing day on the water and hold sailing lessons? TV6's Escanaba Bureau reporter Jessica Stevenson spoke with the captain of the organization to find out more about this adventure. A sailboat adventure for six can be as relaxing or educational as you'd like, all while supporting a local nonprofit. You and your friends can sit back and enjoy the scenery of Little Bay to Knock or get a hands-on sailing lesson from the captain. We'll give them instructions on everything from how to start the engine, uh, explain uh, halyards and sheets and downhauls, and uh, so that by the time they finish, they will actually be sailing the boat. To participate, it's a minimum $200 tax-deductible donation. All proceeds benefit Lake State Industries, an organization that has close ties to the captain and his family. We also have a special needs daughter who's 40 years old, and she's been at Lake State's for well over 20 years. Um, it's just a fantastic organization. Um, it offers uh, the disabled um, uh, folks in this community opportunities to work, to have a dignity of life, and to get a paycheck about every two weeks, which is, makes all the difference in the world. Lake State is a nonprofit organization that provides vocational training, social interaction, and finds jobs for people with barriers. I like my paycheck every two weeks. Makes me happy. Makes everybody proud. Lots of friends and lots of uh, good people there, and that's the way we like it. Donations like the ones received from the sailboat adventure help Lake State continue to provide these opportunities. Well, it's always great when people want to stand behind Lake State Industries and support us. Uh, we know we're doing a great job. We can see it on the smiles of the people we serve. If you'd like to book a sailboat adventure and support Lake State Industries, visit UpperMichiganSource.com. Jessica Stevenson, TV6 News, Escanaba.